All right, what's up, guys? Welcome to another technical recap. So this is episode two. I'm going to be covering um, end phase and solar edge. Now, if we look at the one day for end phase right now, the RSI is moving towards a bullish direction. Um, and the other bullish thing about end phase is that their stock price is in a divergence with the MACD. So this, um, you know, is a uh, bullish thing for end phase because uh, we are starting to see more strength over here. Um, after it bounced off the uh, 155 level, um, I did get in pretty late. I think uh, I have averages at 165. Um, and I did talk about it, uh, buying it at 152. And I really don't think it's going to happen. Um, so, I mean, if it gets there, it's good. You know, I have a chance to buy more. But I really don't think it's going to get there anymore. So, um, once we look at the one hour, I think my thesis that it's more bullish um, is going to be, uh, you know, more explainable because there's more data right here. So, um, end phase did form a triple top here at around 165 and it broke out of that triple top at uh, last Friday. So, uh, this caused the 20 MAs to bounce up above the 50 MAs for the one hour. And that's a great thing, but uh, you know that there is some cases that um, the RSI is starting to move down, so we might see a correction. Um, now, where will that correction uh, go to? Uh, you know, it's it's all theoretical, but I think it might go back down to 165. And yeah, so that's usually how that works. Um, resistance becomes support levels. Uh, so that's my hope for end phase uh, for the one hour. Um, so will it get back to 152? I really don't think so uh, because uh, the energy demand is, you know, it's increasing. And I think solar is locked in as uh, one of the legit providers of energy. So let's look at Solar Edge right now. Um, solar Edge, I, in the past, I said to look for a direction. Now, uh, Solar Edge is known to form very prominent supports, which will be important later as I move in uh, closer to the one hour. Um, so I did talk about it, uh, buying it at 210. And I don't think it's going to get there anymore um, because I think things have changed with Solar Edge. Um, so I, I was sort of right on look, looking for a direction. Um, I did not buy in. And, you know, it's worked out so far, but, uh, you know, I, I might be wrong here. Um, now, if we look at the one day, the RSI is also um, like end phase. Uh, it is moving up in a bullish direction. Uh, and the MACDs is in a huge divergence right now with the, uh, well, no, it's not at a divergence exactly. I think it's more of a... Well, yeah, it's a divergence. I'm just going to say it. It's a divergence. Um, so, again, Solar Edge is known to form very prominent supports. We had one support over here at 259. And, you know, it's starting to form a support over here at 240, I would say. Uh, so, if it ever gets there, I, I think that would be a, you know, a good buy for Solar Edge. Um yeah so let's look let's zoom into the one hour right now uh once again the one hour um the rsi looks like it's uh, going to curl down so we might see a correction here um as for uh where it will correct to uh there was not a triple top like end phase so uh you know you can pull out the Fibonacci's and sort of uh, measure here uh so it might go back down to 256 uh that's just based on the fibonacci's so the 20 ma's just crossed well i say just but it crossed a few days ago uh, the 20 ma's crossed the 50 ma's um on tuesday and you know we are starting to see it uh try to cross the 200 ma's and once that does cross um it's gonna be pretty bullish for end phase i mean no not end phase solar edge uh the stock price is also above the 200 ma's which is known to be a good thing but i uh, still think there might be a small correction here um, based on both the rsi and the macd's so yeah um 
that's what I think of Solar Edge. Uh, that is once again just to recap a support at two hundred and around thirteen, well two hundred and forty. I'll just say that. And then um, end phase, uh, there might be a support at a hundred and sixty five. Uh, so that's what I think of uh, FAS Solar Edge. Uh, thanks for watching Technical Recap Episode 2. Uh, as always, um, stay safe, guys. Okay, so yeah.